Today is Palm Sunday, which marks the beginning of Holy Week. The week usually filled with religious gatherings and traditions, but due to the coronavirus, many time-honored traditions have been canceled. 2 News reporter Leah Williamson shows us how Miami Valley Church is reaching out to its congregation. Passing out palm fronds on a Palm Sunday is a tradition that dates back hundreds of years, but during these unprecedented times of a pandemic, this local church is finding a new way to help their congregation celebrate and recognize this Holy Week. Palm Sunday is uh, it, it's it's an important day. People receive their palms and they they cherish them all year long. It's not exactly the way parishioners at Queen of Martyrs Catholic Church would want to recognize the important tradition of Palm Sunday, but they're making do with what they can. They can't be here physically to come in and, and receive mass today and receive the Eucharist, but as one small gesture, we, we can be here and do that, but we're going to do it safely. People of all backgrounds and parishes were invited to drive their cars to the church and receive a palm from a safe distance and with an abundance of caution. In addition to the palm to take home, they also received a warm smile and some kind words from church leaders. It's something that we thought that our very close-knit community needed to bring us together. The parish has been sticking close together since even before the pandemic. The crazy thing is last year when that, that tornado hit, it, it pretty much, no one could attend mass here. We had one of our, uh, another parish in our in our uh, region offered us uh, the, the use of their their parish so if that doesn't tell you what family is i don't know what does the church is still rebuilding from the tornado damage but their faith is guiding them through the many tough situations the year has brought right now that's all we have except for each other of course and and uh always as always god is always there for all of us at all the time olia williamson two news working for you